What's up, music peeps? I'm Chris the Dre, musician. For gaming's my instrument, what's yours? And this instrument that I'm playing is Sonic Adventure 2, and this time we're going to venture into this dark side story, so let's go ahead and jump in. Alright, so first stage is Iron Gate, and we're playing as Dr. Eggman first. Playable characters is Shadow, Eggman, and Rouge. Rouge is Knuckles. Uh, Eggman is obviously, you see, has Tails' gameplay, and his Shadow is Sonic's gameplay, so... Okay, so it's really dark. Like, my TV is, like, really, really dark. I don't know why. I show up better, uh, show up brighter in the game, or in the game, but in the video, so that's recording, so, hopefully. Wait, what? Anyway, hopefully, um, we can get through this level. I should know this level well enough to actually try to get through in the dark, so, I should be fine. And this is one day after recording the Hero Side Story, so I've somewhat gotten over my cold. Uh, not quite sure, because it's one in the mo uh, not one in the morning, it's one in the afternoon. I woke up at like 11, and I live in Southwest Missouri currently, so let's just see what happens. Oh. This is hilarious how easy this is, but that's because I've played it so many times in the past. I remember whenever Movie Gallery was the thing, I would always rent this game for the Nintendo GameCube. That is why I'm playing it on currently, but anyway, I used to always rent it and for Dark Side Story, I, w I could never get past the security hall stage for whatever reason at all. And I don't know. I don't, I, I don't remember why I couldn't get past it. Probably because I didn't know how to activate the safes because some of the Chaos Emeralds were hidden in safes that were not activated. So, uh, I didn't know how to activate those. And even after hitting Omotile, and Omotile probably said something about it once or twice, but yeah. But I think, I can't remember when I was actually able to get through that. When I, I know it's whenever I have my own copy of Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, so... Hello, Mr. Gun Robot. Anyway, sometime whenever I got my own copy, I was actually able to pass Security Hall because I guess I was older and I realized exactly what happened. And it's also... I find it, find it, blah, blah. I find it a little bit hilarious how, like, when you're younger, you really don't know what's going on or how to pass the game or um, do anything but once you get older you realize like easier like it's easier when you get older because you realize oh hey I need to do this how should I do this well I do it like this like you actually process in your head hey and then once you play through the game a couple of times, it just comes kind of taking nature to you. Then you just find like shortcuts and now you know why all that I jazz. The best. And Eggman thinks my mighty highly of himself. He always does though, although he gets beat by Sonic all the time. So So 
This is the military's top secret weapon. It's a lot smaller than I expected. Enter user data. Enter password. Password is Maria. Maria. Now all I have to do is to place the Chaos Emerald into this console. I would think that that keyboard was in Japanese considering he only typed three characters. I'm sorry, but I'm with Shari on this one. You should see from first sight that it's not a blue hedgehog. Alright, so same as in the hero story. This is kind of the same boss that Sonic uh, fought over in City Escape. So, uh, wait a minute, is this hot shot or I can't remember. Oh, shoot. I was about to say, I'd better hit that. <laughs> anyway, this is just like uh, what Sonic fought over in City Escape in the Hero Side story. So, if you fought Sonic, uh, fought him in Sonic first, then it should be easier for the Dark Side. So, Shadow, you are the military's top secret weapon. But what did you mean when you said you will grant me a wish? Bring more Chaos Emeralds. Shadow, wait! I'll be waiting for you in the central control room on the Space Colony Ark. 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 We'll see about that bat girl. And by the way, that screen sounded more provocative than it should have. But anyway, Dry Lagoon, like Knuckles' this first stage, is like, uh, it's a two sort of, uh, has two locations, really. And this is, on which I will go into detail, really, uh, what each place is called, but... We don't have time for that. Well, you you guys might have time for that. I kind of don't. 
I could if I want to, but my thing is I just want to uh, get past this because I'm marathoning the uh, dark side story just like I did the hero side story, which is what I was actually meaning to tell you guys earlier ago. But anyway, I said it, so there you go. Don't tell me the air was in there. Nope. It's on this side. Up here somewhere. Oh! It was right there the whole time. Oh well. I can grab the other two right quick. Right there. Underwater. No, it's not underwater. Oh, I kind of have an excuse for that one. It blended in with the background very well, so I wasn't able to find it that easily. Let's see if the third one's over here on this side. Nope, it's in the other side of the whole place, so. Let's hitch a ride on this turtle and head back up. Hello? That's actually kind of hilarious because I was actually on the turtle going over there and I actually didn't see that emerald or that piece there so How was that? that was pretty How clever Sonic team I'll give you that one alright so just like Knuckles' first stage that was pretty easy okay I thought they were storyline I guess that'll happen right after um Send ocean. Return to hidden base. Those idiots will never find my hidden base inside this pyramid. <laughs> Let's take care of business here first, then get inside. Let's take care of business here and then get inside. Because gun soldiers are currently looking for Eggman's base. Or I think the pyramid base is um, Gun's headquarters. Or not Gun's headquarters, but. Yeah, either belongs to Gun or Gun is uh, trying to look for Eggman's base. I see a bunch of Gun flags, so I'm guessing they're. I don't know. You guys in the comments can tell me, so. So, like tell like tell the stages. Oh, yeah, I already told you this because uh, the first stage was Eggman stage. Yeah, I like I like the music for uh, this song though. It sounds kind of sneaky in a sort of way. Whoa, something just happened. I don't know what it was either. Kinda can't hear the music that well though because I have the TV turned down low because I'm not trying to have the mic pick up the TV because the capture device is already capturing the sound that it needed. Which by the way, I think the sound probably for the, for the hero story might sound a little bit weird, like as if uh, the speakers are messed up. I think that has something to do with the game itself though. I'm not quite sure why because with Metroid Prime it never like that was not a concern so it might be something within the audio video cables of the GameCube or it's just the game itself I don't know I like to think that it's just the uh, game itself because otherwise all any other games that I record on GameCube will kind of have that same effect but then again Sonic Adventure didn't have that problem so it might just be the game anyway uh, hopefully this is a little bit better I Tweak the sound a little bit to, uh, like, to where you can still hear storyline, but to where it doesn't, it's not obvious that something weird is going on with the sound.
Let's see, we should be, we should already be halfway through the stage now. Because I've been blabbing all the freaking level. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know why I thought those, uh, gun sentry drones were coming around. Like, how I knew that. It has been a while since I played Sonic Adventure 2. But then again, I've been watching people like, uh, like some call me Johnny, or I just I was calling John from uh, Super Gaming Bros. Anyway, I've been watching him play it, although it was kind of a live stream that kind of got placed onto his channel. I think that was him testing out the YouTube gaming stuff though too. But then again, I was too busy to actually check that stuff out. And which, by the way, I need to uh, I actually need to watch some. Um, videos by some other people I subscribe to because I subscribe to them but I actually hadn't seen their videos probably because probably because uh, nothing has been on my front screen because, uh, because because they probably hadn't done much content but I do need to drop by though a green shield You know what's hilarious? I was on Twitter the other day and Elijah Elfo or was just trying to figure out a new I guess uh, he was gonna to try to change his name or something. And so he was asking us to uh, give him to uh, give him suggestions for a new name. I gave him I gave him the name the Feigned F E I G N E D Dolphin. But then again, I would do something like that because my name is kind of like that, uh, a proposition, a proposition, wait a minute, preposition followed by an adverb, or adverb, adjective followed by a noun, so, 